It's a busy afternoon in New York City's Times Square, a high-profile area long considered a target for terrorism. But if someone was looking to set off a bomb here, these dogs may sound the alarm earlier than ever before. And they're no ordinary bomb-sniffing dogs. They are what's called vapor-wake dogs, trained not only to sniff out bombs in bags, but to pick up the scent or vapor of a bomb as it wafts through the air, something the human nose can't detect. The very function of these wonderful, wonderful dogs is in fact to protect against exactly what happened in Belgium. Even on a busy New York City street, these dogs can pick up the scent of a bomb in the air. The vapor that they recognize could come from a person's clothing, perhaps the bomb maker who walks right by them, or from a backpack which may contain the bomb. The dogs were trained at Auburn University. We visited the university after the 2013 Boston Marathon bombing to see the training firsthand. The point of a vapor wake dog is to detect the vapor of the bomb, if you will, before it's actually placed somewhere where it might explode. That's to catch it before that. That is exactly correct. Your, your standard bomb dog, your explosive detector dog, is primed on looking at an object, uh, uh, a backpack that's, that's placed somewhere. A vapor wake dog's ability is to detect the odor coming off of that backpack on the back of someone as they carry it. Amazing. And to follow that plume of vapor. This video from the university shows a vapor wake dog in action. Once he catches the odor in the air, watch how he never lets up. There are eight vapor wake dogs now deployed to protect soft targets in the New York City area. They just graduated the NYPD's training this week and each is named after a fallen NYPD officer. In a world where suicide bombings continue to be the weapon of choice for terrorists throughout the world, the CRC's capability to deploy these vapor wake dogs is more important than ever before. These pups are always working, zigzagging through the crowds, sniffing everyone and everything they come into contact with, including our camera. If one of these dogs does pick up the scent of a bomb, he can follow the plume or bomb vapor up to the length of several football fields. If the vapor leads him to a suspect, he will stop when the suspect stops and sit down to alert his handler. Why are these dogs so good at their jobs? Because their nose has 220 million cells to pick up a scent, compared to 5 million in the human nose. In the world of counterterrorism, they are truly man's best friend. Randy Kay, CNN, New York.